The traffic on Wilshire Boulevard in Los Angeles is worse than normal tonight because President Obama is in town and tomorrow he's coming to San Diego. Air Force One landed in L.A. about two hours ago and then the president was flown to a private home in Bel Air. Tomorrow he flies to La Jolla for lunch, the home of Qualcomm founder Erwin Jacobs. 10 News reporter Allison Ash is live now with why at least one prominent Democrat may make a point of not being here. Allison? Yeah, you know, lunch here tomorrow costs ten thousand dollars a plate. That's the home where it's all going to happen. The home of Irwin Jacobs back there at the end of the cul-de-sac, which overlooks the ocean. Quiet here right now, but just you wait until tomorrow. This is the view from Sky Ten of Irwin Jacobs' sprawling estate in La Jolla. But President Barack Obama isn't coming here to look at the Pacific Ocean. He's here to shake down rich Democrats. He's on his last hurrah, has no more elections in front of him. So now he's looking at his legacy, not only his administration legacy, but his political legacy. And his political legacy is going to be to help candidates in the off-year off, off elections. One of those candidates is Congressman Scott Peters. The first-term Democrat is in a neck-and-neck -neck race with Republican Carl DeMaio. But Peters may be distancing himself from Obama. He's staying in Washington and avoiding the photo op with the lame duck president in La Jolla. Well, with the president's poll ratings so low right now, one of the lowest, uh, it's not a complete surprise at all. Obama, who spent Wednesday with people who lost everything to tornadoes in Arkansas, will spend Thursday with people who have everything. But political analysts say he may not be able to get as much money out of them as he used to. The core donors are going to show up, but they have to do a cost calculation. If it looks like 2014 is going Republican anyway, save your ammunition for 2016. So I would expect the president will have a harder time going to the till, the California ATM, now than he did back in years past. One thing is certain, this quiet neighborhood will soon be filled with both Obama lovers and haters who will line the streets to watch his motorcade roll by. And there are hundreds of these no parking signs lining the streets for blocks. We've all also already seen some people out here scouting out places where they can maybe watch the motorcade. One woman says she is going to try to pose for a selfie with President Obama. Don't think that's going to happen because the Secret Service will be crawling all over the place here come tomorrow. We're live in La Jolla. Allison Ash, 10 News.